catch a monster. Announced by Talia. Look at that. He needs to brush his teeth. Feels like a toothbrush bristle, huh? You must never touch a monster who has smiled at you and waved. It may look warm and friendly, but it isn't well behaved. What's his tummy feel like? Bumpy. Yeah, spaced Ooh. bumps. Kind of rough spaced bumps, huh? It's smooth, kind of. Yeah. You must never touch a monster who has asked you round for tea. It wants to put you in a pot and eat you, probably. What does this one feel like? Feels bumpy. Yeah, feels like he wants to get you in his tea. Okay. You must never touch a monster. It's a silly thing to do. Ignore it if it smiles and says, Hello there, how are you? Is that monster? This one feels friendly. I would trust this monster. It's the same size space bumps. You can weave through it like it's a river hitting rocks. You must never touch a monster. You should always hurry by. Just keep on walking past it and don't look it in the eye. Why does this monster only have one eye? Because it's a one-hide, two-horn flying purple people eater with little bumps. And these are little close-together bumps. So, and it's a tongue. So many bumps. Oh, it is a tongue. Those are like, it's taste buds. It really wants to eat us. Okay. And don't ever touch a monster who is hungry for its lunch. It might just see you coming and decide to take a munch. And then you would be in his tummy. And this, one of these bumps would be you. Because he's big. Oh. And that is the... Oh, and that's his bite, huh? Look at that. Look at that big bite he took out of the book. And that is the end of Never Touch a... What, Talia? Monster! Monster! Say adios! 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 Never Touch a Monster. No, a dragon. <laughs> yeah. So here is a dragon. There is a dragon. All right. Never Touch a Dragon. You must never touch a dragon that has curvy, curly claws. Distract it with a sandwich and run away indoors. What does this feel like, Talia? Look at these shapes. It feels like rectangles, long and skinny rectangles. Ugh, oh, you touch that dragon. He probably ate you like a sandwich. You must never touch a dragon with a twisty, twirly tail. Just hang a sign around its neck and put it up for sale. Yeah, don't trust this dragon. Its tail is so smooth. It's probably like a lizard tail that falls off if you touch it. Don't you think, Talia? <laughs> yeah. You must never touch a dragon that has a weird and wavy wings. Just leave it with a microphone and sneak off while it sings. Okay. Well, oh, those are wavy wings. Those do feel wavy, don't they? What do they feel like to you? Weird and wavy? Bumpy, yeah, kind of wavy, baby. bumpy. You must never touch a dragon that has lumpy, bumpy skin. Just turn your house into a fort that dragons can't get in. Is this lumpy and bumpy? bumpy lumpy, it is lumpy, lumpy and bumpy. It feels pretty soft, though. I'd let that dragon in. How about you? Would you let the dragon in? Yeah. And don't ever touch a dragon with a smoky, sparking mm. snout. Just find a hose and splash its nose before the flames come out. Oh, oh! Yeah. It's a good thing we splashed the nose. We wouldn't even be able to touch this wavy, nice-feeling nose, huh? Well, and that was it, Talia. That was the end of You Must Never Touch a Dragon. Would you still touch a dragon, even though this book warned you not to? Yeah. Yeah. Me too. All right. Adios! You saying adios? Adios! Polar bear. Yes, that was announced by Talia on Apollo Reads. Never touch a polar bear. You must never touch a polar bear who's learning how to knit. If you laugh at his new scarf, he won't like you one bit. What does the scarf feel like, Talia? It feels like squishy. Symbols and signs. All right. 
You must never touch a penguin who skates past in a flash, and make sure not to giggle if he falls down with a crash. What does this feel like? It feels bumpy. Yeah, bumpy. Nice. Smooth and bumpy. <laughs> you must never touch a seal if he is sliding in the snow, but say hello politely and he'll let you have a go. What bumpy. is this? Smooth. Yeah, different sized bumps, so it's like big bump, little bump, huh? And smooth, yeah. You must never touch an arctic fox aboard a fishing boat. It's rude to touch a fox who's trying hard to stay afloat. What does the fox's tail feel like? Feel soft. Yeah, soft. Kind of like fins in a way. A bunch of rubber fins. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like fingernail texture almost. So never touch these Arctic friends who chill out on the ice. Don't stand near, but clap and cheer, and they'll do something nice. What does that one feel like? Pokey. A little pokey. Uh, this one is kind of grippy. It's like a little rubber grip. All right, that's the end of Polar Bear. Never touch a polar bear. Okay, so let's say adios. Adios! Adios!